Hey everyone, and welcome to the channel. Today, we're gonna to be attempting to fill up these glass bottles I've been collecting over the last few months full of water. That way, when I hit them, they'll play a specific note. Now, I'm not really sure if it's gonna work. Um, I'm not sure if this is gonna be long enough to get as many notes as I want. I'm trying to get seven or eight so I can do a scale. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. As you can see, when I hit the glass bottle, there's a note that's played. If I fill it up with some more water, you're gonna have a different note. And so the idea is I need to get seven or eight of these arranged so I can play a whole scale. So as you can see right here, I have six different bottles with different amounts of water in them. And I spent a lot of time using a tuner trying to tune every single one of these to a specific note. Problem is, as temperature changes, so does the frequency and so does the note. So they sound pretty close, they're not perfect, but the problem is the cylinder is not long enough to do more than these six notes and a scale. So the workaround I'm gonna have to do is I'm going to have to sample the sound of probably this one right here, and then put it into Logic Pro X and sample it so I can get all the notes that I want. Unfortunately, my idea of just playing all these probably won't work but there is a workaround with technology. All right, so what I'm gonna do now is I got the glass bottle here and my microphone. I'm gonna record it into my software and sample it. That way it has the sound of the glass bottle, but I can change the frequency of the sound. So let's just click record right now. All right, now that I got that sampled, I'm gonna to have to do some work now to get it exactly how I want it to sound, get the right waveform of all those hits that I got. So once I've done that, I'll bring you guys back and we will see what the outcome is. All right, here we are in Logic Pro X. As you can see right here, this is the audio that I recorded of the glass bottle. So if I come down here, that's the note. But now that I've sampled it, what I've gone ahead and done, I'm gonna go back here. You can see I've changed different notes here. And as I play it, it has, we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Well there you go everyone, there's a quick little fun video I put together showing you how you can sample a glass bottle and make an arrangement with it. Hopefully this video was fun for you to watch, if it was please do leave a like on this video and comment down below. And until next time guys, keep rocking on. Thank you.